Hello and welcome to The Featherweight Shop. I'm Carmen and we get questions about where we find our featherweight machines that are so shiny and beautiful. Well, the truth is when we receive them in the shop, they're not always this shiny and beautiful. Generally, they need a lot of cleaning and polishing before they have that brilliant look. So today I'm gonna to show you the products and walk you through the process that we use here at The Featherweight Shop to clean and polish these machines. We've even put together a polishing kit featuring the same products and tools that our tech department uses. The surface of your featherweight actually has three layers. There's the beautiful black featherweight paint, and then the featherweight decals, and finally there's a thin protective clear coat that covers both the paint and decals. Cleaning and polishing not only gives a nice shiny luster to the machine, but it also puts a fourth layer of hard protective wax on the surface. This layer helps your fabric glide along the surface, plus it helps protect the clear coat from excessive wear. First, prepare the surface by wiping off any dust with a dry cotton cloth and removing any tape or stickers. Use a tiny bit of sewing machine oil and gently remove them with your fingernail or a plastic razor. This will remove most any tape. If your clear coat is in good shape, our tech department will sometimes use a tiny bit of kerosene to remove very stubborn tape. Never use alcohol or acetone or any citrus-based products because they will damage your clear coat. Of course, this only applies to black featherweight machines because only black featherweights have a clear coat. You can use these products on your white and tan featherweights, provided you do not use them over the Singer decal found on the light and neck. Acetone will remove these decals. Keep in mind that almost every black featherweight has some clear coat wear, exposing the paint and decals. Now it's important to protect these areas from further damage but it isn't always easy to actually see where the clear coat is thin or missing. Some time ago, we discovered that a black light will highlight the areas of clear coat damage. Even though this machine is beautiful, with very little visible wear, the black light shows each area where the clear coat has been compromised. We want to avoid putting any oil on these areas when we are cleaning. And eventually, we will put a nice protective coat of hard wax there to protect them. The Featherweight Shop is always improving the techniques and products we use for our machines. For years, we used water-based polishes, but recently, our tech department developed our own proprietary petroleum-based cleaning and polishing formulas that we call So Retro Clean and So Retro Shine. The So Retro Clean and So Retro Shine formulas are specifically developed to work with the vintage era shellac clear coat found on all black featherweight machines. But our formula can also be used on your tan and white featherweights as well. In fact, it is quite useful on any painted sewing machine. After preparing the machine, apply a little bit of the Sew Retro Clean paste to a cotton rag and apply to a small area using back and forth and up and down motions. Use very light pressure in those areas where the clear coat is rubbed down or rubbed off. Once the area is clean, Wipe down that spot with another clean cotton cloth. Move on to the next area until the whole machine has been cleaned. Use a microfiber cloth to finish buffing the machine. Then we start polishing with our So Retro Shine. Generally, you only clean your machine thoroughly like this once. But because you polish your machine regularly, 
the So Retro Shine comes in a much larger container. Apply So Retro Shine just like the cleaner, using a clean cotton cloth, using a back and forth and up and down motion, and in a small area. Wipe it down with another cotton rag, then give your machine a final wipe down and buffing using the same microfiber towel as before. The polishing kit includes a supply of our So Retro Clean and So Retro Shine, as well as a microfiber polishing cloth and a keychain black light to show those worn clear coat areas. This So Retro Clean and Shine develops a better polish and shine than anything we've ever tried. It gives a featherweight that beautiful shine, plus it helps protect it for years of further use. I hope this behind the scenes look at how our own tech department cleans and polishes our machines helps you with your own featherweight. If you have any questions on these products and techniques, just give us a call. We're always glad to help.